to Storytime with Fairy Tales and Pirate Tales. Today we'll be reading about the three little pigs. The three little pigs set off to explore the big wide world. Bye bye, called Mummy Pig. And remember to keep away from the big bad wolf. The three little pigs set off. Soon, the first little pig met a man pulling a cart full of straw. Please may I buy your straw to build my house, asked the first little pig. The man was so happy to sell his straw. He was tired of pulling his heavy cart. The first little pig made a house of straw. But that night, the big bad wolf came to call. Little pig, little pig, let me in, he called. No way, said the first little pig. So the wolf huffed and puffed and blew the house down. The first little pig ran away. The second little pig met a man chopping trees in the woods. Please may I buy some sticks to build my house, asked the second little pig. The man was so happy to sell his sticks. He had been chopping them all day. The second little pig made his house in no time. But can you guess who came to call? The big bad wolf. Little pig, let me in, he called. No way, said the little pig. So the wolf huffed and puffed and puffed again and blew the house down. The second pig ran away as fast as he could. The third little pig found some bricks. I'm going to build my house with bricks, said the third little pig to himself. He carried the bricks to the top of the little hill. He laid the bricks, he hammered and sawed. He put on the roof and the windows and the doors. His brick house took a long time to build. The third little pig had a good strong house. No sooner had the third little pig finished his house than he saw his brothers. They were running as fast as they could because the big bad wolf was chasing after them. Come and hide in here, he called. The two little pigs came rushing inside and the third little pig slammed the door shut. Go away, you big bad wolf, they shouted, but the big bad wolf wouldn't go away. Let me in, he called. You can't come in, said the three little pigs. So the big bad wolf huffed and puffed. Nothing happened. He huffed and puffed again. Still, nothing happened. The big bad wolf blew so hard, he made himself dizzy. The three little pigs were safe inside the brick house. The brick house was too strong for the big bad wolf to blow down. I'm coming to get you, growled the big bad wolf. He started to climb down the chimney. The three little pigs were cooking a big pot of hot soup in the fire. The wolf fell down and landed, plop, in the soup. Yowie, shouted the big bad wolf, and he ran outside the house as fast as he could. And the three little pigs never saw the big bad wolf again. And that's the end of our story. Thank you for listening. I'll see you tomorrow night. Good night.